Hey everybody, it's Faith from Fire Sign Tarot. Hope everybody's well. Gemini Cancer, we are doing your cusp baby reading for January, February 2022. Take it if it's yours, leave it if it's not. Time and energy are both fluid. If you're cross watcher up in here, thanks for stopping by. You're going the extra mile to figure your person out, and that's a beautiful and wonderful thing. If you're new, think we might vibe and stuff. You can hit the subscribe button and the notification bell if you want to come back more often. That'd be super cool. If you're returning, welcome back. I have opened comments back up, so if anyone would like to leave a comment, they can feel free. Judgment reversed for a wand reversed. Oh my, oh my. Taking them both. That door's slammed shut, isn't it? Whoa. Whoa. I, I felt that slam. Whoa. Anyway, where was I? Anybody can hit the like button at any time. It is all very much appreciated. It all helps the channel grow and the messages be circulated to those who may need them. Even if your birthday is not on the cusp of Gemini and Cancer and you come across this video, if you take a message out of it, please do so. We're just going to get right into it. Never make a life altering decision based on a tarot rating. I don't care whose cards they are. And again, if it's not your message, leave it on the table and walk away. Dang. Somebody slammed the door on you, or did you slam the door on somebody? Oh, I gotta tip down. Crap. I always forget to tip the camera down. Off to the new or taking a leap of faith. Hmm. Can you handle the truth? Wow. Regaining your balance. Who slammed the door? Okay. Talk to me about this Six of Wands reverse and this Justice card. Six of Wands reversed. Six of Wands reversed. Six of Wands reversed. King of Swords, Page of Swords. Wow! Hmm. 
Nine of Wands, Ten of Wands. You're ignoring some and your walls are up. Like not speaking to someone bad attitude and maybe because they're not noticing you, maybe because they're ignoring you. I don't know, but there's bad attitudes, walls. One on justice, please. Pages, page of swords, knight of swords. That just kind of flew out and landed where it needed to go. Challenge may be coming back in to level the playing field. Maybe the challenge is finding the words. You feel like you want to level things up. Maybe they're ignoring you. Why the world reversed? Again, place yourself where you see fit. Five of swords, six of swords. Unfinished business. Oh gosh. Just fall where you want to fall. Go for it. Judgment upright in the world. You want to settle this. This is, okay, whatever is unfinished is about to be settled. World reversed, five of swords, judgment world. This needs to be settled before somebody can move on, and it's about to be. Why the Knight of Cups? Eight of swords, nine of swords. <laughs> Can't find the words. Either you want to come back to somebody, or somebody wants to come back to you, but whoever wants to do the coming back is anxious as crap right now. Hmm. Queen of Swords, King of Swords, but... <laughs> Because this this is going to be a conversation. The whole fan. The whole fam damnly of swords is here, man. Hierophant lovers. Oh. And there's the light bulb moment. The Hierophant and the Lovers. Somebody's got something to say. You got somebody coming back, can't find the words to say to you. They can't find the words to fix this. You slammed the door shut. They can't find the words. Why the three of wands reversed? Ten of swords, ace of swords, it's over. Done deal. You waited at that dock long enough, you're done. Ten of wands, ace of wands, six of wands, seven of wands. At the very least, a playing field is going to be leveled. I don't see you going back to this. The last sword is dropped. The wands are the wands are down. You're done. But this, this return could lead to an internal struggle. Magician reversed, high priestess reversed, manipulation. Three of coins, four of coins in the reverse. You're letting it go because this isn't this isn't something to build on. You're letting it go. 
this isn't going to manifest. Somebody's ego is way too wounded here. Or you're going to end up wounding somebody's ego. Six of Swords, the Seven of Swords, yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. Conversations to be had. Okay, we're not going to beat that dead horse anymore. Let's find out why it happened. This is where it you know, starts to resonate with people. Why the King of Cups reversed? Why did it happen? Why did it happen? Why the King of Cups reversed? Knight of Coins, Queen of Coins. Queen of Coins, King of Coins. Really? Oh, really? That's a whole lot of stability, but not a lot of emotion. Page of coins to the knight of coins. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Beating, beating that again, beating a dead horse. That is a whole lot of stability. Not a lot of emotion. There's no love there. There was no love here. Somebody comes riding in. Knight of Wands. Somebody's got a difficult choice to make. Talk to me about the Knight of Wands and the Two of Swords. Empress. Emperor. Oh gosh. That's <laughs> Throw one more on that, but I already know where this is going. Sun reversed, judgment reversed. And that's where the door got slammed. Somebody wrote in. Somebody left. For a better match. Slammed the door. Because they weren't happy. Ace of Swords reversed. Six of Swords. Didn't fire off. No communication. Shoppy waters. Moving on. Hanged man death. Accept the fate of the situation. Allow what needs to close out to close out. It's it just it died. Guys, it died. This is like soul moving transformation here. Ace of Wands, two of Wands. New starts, new paths, new journeys. New journeys. Three of Cups reversed to the Four of Cups reversed. And the ignoring of the person, third party situation, all that jazz. But there's communication coming in. There's communication coming in. Talk to me about that Knave of Swords. Talk to me about that Knave of Swords. Three of Wands to the Four of Wands. What do you do with that? Place yourself where you see fit, because this just got all kinds of confusing. Somebody's waiting for that door to go. 
do you let them walk back through that door? Are they going to come in with truth? And if you're the one going back to somebody, are you going to come back in with truth? Are they going to open the door back up? Ace of Cups, Two of Cups in the Upright. Wow. Wow. Can this come back together? Or do you go off and start something new? That's a crossroads, yo. King of Cups, your first page of Cups. You just sit there in your head and keep your mouth shut. Not say anything. Why the Eight of Swords reversed? Seven of Wands, Eight of Wands. Do you come out of your head enough to finally open your mouth and speak? Do you beat that demon of self-doubt? Or they? All things are vice versa, guys. Five of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Into the six of wands are just, just going to pop off into a conflict when they come back. Okay, I need a moonology. This got real emotional. <laughs> and super confusing. Gemini Cancer. Adjustments are required. Third quarter moon. Where is that page? Pod me loves. I'm trying to find third quarter moon. There it is. Think of yourself as a vessel that has been filled more and more over the past few weeks. Some of what has come your way may have been wonderful, but there's also a lot of negativity and you need to let go of this whatever situation you're asking about now. Be honest about whether there are toxic emotions involved, which you need to release into the ethers. This card also comes with the promise that all is not lost. However, there are changes or adjustments required before you will get to where you want to be. A change of course is forecast now that recent events have been understood and acted upon. There may also be a crisis now which will remind you what you want and what it's time to let go of, so pay attention. Wisdom Oracle. You got a two for change of the wind and exchanging gifts. Change in the wind, number 12. Essential meanings a sense that unseen change has been initiated, preparation for a storm. Awareness that your plans are not on firm ground. Feeling a shift. Uncertainty about which direction the winds will blow. It's human nature to yearn for certainty and resist change. To want the world to remain consistent. Like a zebra's stripes. Yet, nothing 
nothing in human experience is black and white, nor will anything remain static. The one thing guaranteed is change. Now is a time of transformation as outer conditions are temporarily moving out of sync with your desires and expectations. Stay the course and remember that even storms serve to clear the air, scatter seeds, and nourish the soil for better things ahead. Life is about to get interesting. Anticipate it with curiosity as you wonder what is coming in on shifting winds. The unknown is where the magic lies. Oh my, my, my. Number 27. Exchanging gifts. The law of giving and receiving. Currency, trade-offs, weighing costs, and determining value. You're entering into a productive and enriching time when all manner of opportunities are being offered to you. You have everything you need to seize them, yet in order to honor them, you must put them in time, exchange your experiences and skills, and commit heart and soul to what you're choosing to pursue. Can you do it? You have what it takes to be successful if you align the law of giving and receiving. You must exchange and dance of give and take, push and pull, doing and being. If you let fear guide your choices, you could deplete yourself or create an imbalance. This is not the time of just do, do, do. Use your currency wisely and be mindful of the value others bring to your life. Gemini Cancer Cusp Babies, this has been your reading for January, February 2022. Know that you are loved, be blessed, and peace, love, and light to you. We'll catch you next month.